What is going on, Libra? Hey there. And this is Renee. Welcome back. Libra, we're going to take a look at your next 48 hours. What's going on? What you can expect? What's coming forward for you? The next 48 hours, okay? It's coming in for Libra. Sun, moon rising, and Venus. The star. Beautiful energy, okay. The five of swords. The chariots. And the seven of swords. <clears throat> At the bottom we have the eight of wands. Libra, okay, here's the thing. I think that things are moving pretty fast for you. I feel like there's some sort of communication. Um some sort of energy around you that is like pushing you into this healing you you've had to heal um or you're going to have to heal after some sort of struggle you know you have healing you have rejuvenation there's some part of you that is being renewed after this struggle after this conflict and I feel like you may feel kind of defeated, Libra, but you have the victory, okay? There's something that you have victory over during the next 48 hours, and you're moving into a better situation. I feel like you're moving into this better situation after this struggle, okay? Um, the universe is providing you that big hug that that you need at the moment and i feel like you're actively walking away from whatever this conflict is whatever this conflict is you're walking away from it you're moving in the direction you need to go because the universe is letting you know that in order for you to have healing you need to move away even though you have victory in this situation Okay, others might see you as defeated, Libra, but you have victory because you have this that they may not have. You know, you are leaving with your, your healing, your dignity, you know, uh, lessons learned from these struggles that you, you have went through. And I feel like this is a very hard lesson that you've had to learn. But whatever the situation is, um, I want to let you know that your angels are letting you know that you have protection. You are being protected during this time. Okay? Um, let's get some more, some more clarity for Libra. <clears throat> Yeah, the Queen of Wands. You're sitting on your throne. You're not sitting back and not taking action. You are moving forward. You're not letting things stop you. You're planting your seeds. You know, whatever this is that has left you this way, it may have been losing a job, losing a um, your place to live um, is what I'm getting. But I feel like you're moving very strongly. You're moving very strongly, Libra. Look, you're not sitting by just feeling like you have been defeated. You're taking action. You're moving very swiftly. You are being aggressive. You're planting seeds and you're walking away with this idea that is going to, you know, help you through the situation. Um, I feel like spirit is... is providing you with this protection to where um, you may be getting ideas um, that may come out of nowhere, okay? And I feel like that's your angels providing you with answers, providing you with the know-how to get through whatever the struggle is, okay? Um, so I feel like, you know, I'm getting a vision of, you just sitting there 
and all of a sudden, you know, you may be doing something totally different, but all of a sudden the answer is going to become clear. Um, so I, I feel like the universe has your back. Your angels are protecting you. They're carrying you on something new, a fresh start, a new journey, you know? So I feel like, you know, whatever this is, this is kind of like a tower moment, but I feel like it's a fresh start. It's not as hard as a tower moment. You're going to have success in what you do. Your, your angels see you. They recognize you. They want you to be successful. Okay? So I feel like that's very beautiful. I feel like all of the options are going to open up. You're going to have more options coming available to you. And I feel like if these are the questions that you are asking, those questions are going to become more clear. You're going to gain the answers to these questions that have been kind of nagging you. Okay? So I feel like that's very, very important for you to hear at this moment, Libra. Um, let's get some clarity on this real quick. <clears throat> Tell me more about this situation. Tell me more about this situation for Libra the next 48 hours. Tell me more about this situation, please. Yeah, what did I say? The Six of Wands. Spirit wants you to be successful, and I feel like you are gaining the reward for that. Even though you may not see it at the moment, you're being recognized. You're being honored, okay? And I feel like there's people around you who want to support you, who want to help you feel grounded, to feel nurtured, to feel loved, to be supported, okay? So somewhere on your journey, you do have this support, whether it be from family, friends, or this could be your spirit guides who are like walking with you through this journey, okay? Um, so I feel like spirit wants you to know that very intensely that you are supported. You are being protected at this time. Okay. Yeah. We, we have a reason for celebration. The three of cups energy. This is my card of you have the support that you need to get through your situation. Okay. This is my support card. You have all of the love and support to get through it. Okay, and I feel like you are actively in search of something better, something with more meaning. Um, so I feel like that's where this fresh start is coming in. You have the fool. So this is a fresh start in something that you're searching for. But I feel like with this full energy being here, whatever this is that you're searching for, you are definitely going to find it. You have the Six of Wands here. That is success. That is feeling that you are grounded. You have a renewal. You know, this is... Like in the original tarot, this they're laying in coffins. They are where they have always been, you know. They have left this world, but, you know, they are being reincarnated. You know, there's a rebirth going on here. There's an expansion. So I feel like, you know, in, in a way you are being, you are going through this, rebirthing stage you know coming into this fresh start having this renewal having a fresh sense of hope and ability okay you found the answers you found the wisdom now you need to put it into action okay so that is beautiful energy for you libra Ooh. at the bottom we have the Knight of Wands. So I feel like this is taking you on a whole new adventure. You may be traveling very soon, um, going on a new journey, um, moving to a new place. Uh, with the Knight of Wands, this is also, you know, not just sitting back, but taking action. You know, being aggressive, being assertive, um, you know, not letting yourself be defeated. OK, 
Okay, so I feel like that's very important for you to hear, Libra. Okay, let's get a card for Libra. What does Libra need to know for the next 48 hours? What is very important for Libra for the next 48 hours? Give me a message, please. Okay, yeah, we have the death card. So there is an ending to something. But there's an ending to something that was not meant for you at this moment. And you are going through this rebirthing stage. So when there's an ending, there's a new beginning right on the other side. I am learning that endings are merely new beginnings. So I, I feel like you're going through this stage of transformation, of rebirth, of like, um, of growth, you know? Uh, you are going into this cocoon as this caterpillar and you are going to be emerging as this beautiful butterfly, okay? Um, let's get a Moonology card. Let's see what Moonology has to say for Libra. Another message for Libra, please. What does Libra need to know for the next 48 hours? What does Libra need to know the next 48 hours? Adjustments are required. There are some things that you're going to have to do. There are adjustments that are going to need to be made. Like I said, you're in the new beginning of this birthing phase. So I feel like, you know, you're learning how to adapt to your situation so and I feel like you you're ready you're capable you're willing so uh, go with the flow okay okay another message for Libra we're gonna take a look at the manifestation monology message for Libra please for the next 48 hours reflect on your priorities <clears throat> excuse me this is Aquarius energy reflect on your priorities so the, there are adjustments that need to be made but it may be that those adjustments need to be made on the priorities that you have set maybe those priorities are out of your range maybe you need to look at them and reset your priorities so that you are more um, you have more attainable goals, you know, look at the short term, look at the long term and set your priorities accordingly. Okay. Um, let's take a look at a message from the universe for Libra. Okay, we have in every moment the universe is conspiring to bring me towards right-minded thinking and the energy of love. Okay, and I feel like the universe is letting you know, hey, this is time to adapt, time to feel renewed, re-energized, you know. I am the loving energy of the universe. Definitely. Now, I don't see a whole lot of love in this reading, but I am going to go ahead and get some love oracles to see kind of where you're at with love, kind of get an idea of where this is going. Now, if you do see love and if this resonates for you as far as love, you know, take it how it resonates. But I'm going to go ahead and get a love oracle message. Okay, we have kisses. Someone loves you unconditionally. There's a giving and receiving of affection and falling in love. So, you know, even though this may not have shown that there's a lot of love in this reading, I feel like someone loves you unconditionally. You have love around you, totally. You know, and there may be someone who is asking you out. Um, on an invitation, maybe to have coffee, maybe to have dinner, lunch, you know, just to spend time with you, get to know you better. There's also a new friendship here. So this 
is beautiful energy for you, my lovely Libra. So this is your reading for the next 48 hours. So if this reading resonates, please like and subscribe. Hit that bell so that you don't miss any uploads. And take a look at your sun, moon, and rising. I have all of the March readings in a playlist for you. So take a look at those and uh, your sun, moon, rising, maybe even your Venus if you're interested in love. And um, that'll give you more clarity on your situation. And Libra. Until your next reading, many blessings to you. Love and light.